always been very careful about um, when I talk about advertising in Wikipedia is that I'm opposed to having advertising in Wikipedia. Um, our board is 100% opposed to having advertising in Wikipedia. But we've also been very careful to never say that absolutely we will never have advertising in Wikipedia for this specific reason. Uh, Wikipedia needs to survive. Um, and there are a lot of uh, potential choices that we could make uh, that would be uh, ways of surviving without going um, insanely commercial. Uh, so from a legal perspective, Wikipedia is owned by the Wikimedia Foundation. Uh, it's a nonprofit organization, it's a charity, um, and that can't be changed and won't be changed. Um, and so the, the, the question would be, you know, let, let's say for example, um, Let's talk about different examples. So one example would be, um, well, we uh, put uh, banner ads on every page of the site and uh, make the maximum possible money. Um, well, okay, that's too much, right? We wouldn't do that. Um, but suppose, for example, only on the search results page, suppose we had a few of the Google ads, you know, when you search over to the side, there's a few ads. It's not in the content, it's only on the search page. That's a lot milder, right? I'm still opposed to that, but it is a lot milder and, and could bring in a significant amount of revenue. There's no reason to do that right now, but I don't think it would be wise for us to say, I would rather shut the project than have that, because Wikipedia is not an anti-commercial project, it's a non-commercial project. Um, and there are a lot of good reasons not to do that, uh, but at the same time, if it became necessary, it would become necessary. Now, I don't anticipate that that will ever be necessary. It's, uh, it's not something that we're facing or even considering right now. Uh, but of course, it is a possibility. So the, the last thing that I always want to say about this is um, it's really uh, important and interesting uh, to think about why we don't want to have advertising in Wikipedia and to make sure that we always make that decision in a thoughtful and responsible way. Um, it's very easy when you have, uh, uh, you know, you're sitting on your laptop uh, working with wireless internet and you have a college education and you're very proud. You say, oh, look at Wikipedia, it's so pure, it doesn't have advertising. But I think we should pause and think, okay, well, we're probably turning down uh, $100 million a year easily, right? $100 million could go a long way towards funding um, access to computers, access to internet, access to knowledge. Um, you could build several universities per year in Africa for this kind of money. <laughs> if, if the question is, should we, uh, should we put ads on the site to bring in $100 million so that the Wikimedia Foundation can build a big building and have fancy salaries, I think everyone would say, no, that's not a good reason. If we say, should we put advertising in Wikipedia to build 20 new universities a year in Africa, I think we have to say, okay, if you're going to say no to that, and I say no to that, you better have a good reason, right? And you better really be thoughtful about that. So for me, that's kind of the way I approach the question. I think in terms of a very, the, the long term for Wikipedia. So the idea of, well, Wikipedia could bring in, um, you know, $100 million next year and do something charitable with it. Okay, yeah, sure, but I think there's actually a bigger uh, potential for uh, leveraging the brand name, getting revenue in other ways. Uh, there are a lot of different things we could do rather than the very simple, you know, slap banner ads in Wikipedia. And so I think that developing the brand in the long run is really important. And part of what is really important about that, like right now when we talk here about, oh, well, you know, what do teachers think about Wikipedia? One thing we know they don't think is they don't think it's, uh, you know, sort of, in the pocket of McDonald's or something like this, or Starbucks, right? No, no one thinks that, right? You know it's a community project, it's a nonprofit. That has a lot of meaning for people, and it, it has a lot of meaning for the volunteer community who writes Wikipedia, uh, things like this. Uh, so I think we can get revenue in other ways. That's a part of it. Um, particularly when we talk about advertising on the actual content pages, right? If you go and you read uh, the entry about uh, Ford Motor Company, right? And if you saw on that page an advertisement for the new Toyota, it, it seems strange to me, right? And it raises questions about the neutrality of the content and so on. So that 
that's disturbing, right? Uh, with deeds in general, I, I don't see any specific needs at the foundation for hundreds of millions of dollars. So. Um, so the the original uh, you know vision for Wikipedia is. Um, you know, a free encyclopedia for every single person on the planet in their own language. And that's a huge goal that extends far beyond having a popular internet site. Um, and so a big part of what I'm personally interested in is the growth of Wikipedia in the languages of the developing world. Um, in particular, uh, the languages of India, the languages of Africa. There's a huge amount of uh, work to be done there and there's some really promising things going on with those languages beginning to grow fast as those people are coming online for the first time. Um, another part of that mission is, um, well that's why I'm here today, uh, is thinking about, okay, well in languages, uh, we have languages like Spanish, right, where the Wikipedia itself is quite highly developed, it's a very large language, how many, 600,000, right, so it's a very large project, very active community, uh, very good work. But we also know that there are a large number of people who are not on the internet yet. Um, and so it's thinking about, okay, well, how do we begin to think about distributing um, all of this work this volunteer community has built? And a big part of the inspiration for the volunteers um, is um, thinking about how to get knowledge out to everyone. To how, how can we help uh, with the digital divide, with the knowledge divide? How can we make sure that, um, you know, the, the the next uh, uh, genius, right, who will uh, invent something that will save us all from global warming or what have you, uh, but happens today to be growing up in a poor area where they don't really have access to uh, knowledge, how can we help get them knowledge? And that's an inspiration for a lot of the volunteers. And so I think it's really important that we really start pushing forward to say, let's make sure that what we have isn't just on the internet, that it actually reaches more people. Mm -hmm.